a lot has changed in 2023. It was the hottest year in living record. But maybe that's about to be a problem in the past. See, 2023 was the year of artificial intelligence. We now refer to everything as AI. That said, ChatGPT does have its uses. In a year of incredible space age technology, a commercial deep sea submarine was controlled by a Logitech F710. Probably should have used AI. Brianna nailed a halftime show. But the great debate of the year was whose tom was bigger, Taylor Swift, or Beyonce, or the NFL. Across the pond, King Charles finally ascended the throne in a lavish ceremony. Basic necessities cost more for the common person than ever before. Meanwhile, Harry and Meg's embarked on their worldwide privacy tour before getting dropped by Spotify for not doing any work. The Royals? Better get some more frostbitten Tajik stories. Sir, where was I? I got too busy thinking about the Roman Empire. Elon Musk bought Twitter and drove it into the toilet. It's now 500 yards deep in shit-smelling foulness I can't even imagine. Or maybe I don't want to. Well, we go now to take ill-informed sides on incredibly nuanced global conflicts. X? Everybody's favorite crypto hobbit could get 111 years in Shawshank Prison. Joining me, Andy Dufresne, and Top G. Sam Bankman not so freed. Brittany was freed, though. The biggest question was were you going to Barbie or Oppenheimer? Or were you doing Barbieheimer? Everyone was Barbie, it seemed. Except Ken. Everyone is Ken. With a ludicrously capricious bag. In a stand-up tour rife with controversies, Matt raised everyone's girlfriends. But he was actually trying to riz the guys. Hmm. In the story of the most publicized jawline since 1975. Gonna need a helmet for that one, Matt. On the old television box, every single show was Pedro Pascal delivering a magical child to safety. Now, my team told me not to say this, but uh, they didn't say I couldn't sing. Toxic Gossip Train continued as Beastie Boy built wells in Africa and got sued for his beastie burgers. Donald Trump lost all of his money, as well as getting banned from running in Colorado and Maine. Looks like Sleepy Joe's gonna get back in. I hope 2024 will be better. I hope people won't do so much fucking dumb shit. I hope.